My video has been uploaded from Google Drive um, and it has been processed by CapCut and it's now ready to be dragged into the timeline. So from my media upload folder here, I can click on my cloud option and click on here over here, see my other work that I've already done, but I want to work on my project. So I'm going to isolate that. I'm going to click on the icon here and I'm going to drag it down to my timeline and we can see that I've got um, a single piece of video on the timeline no audio yet or additional audio there'll be audio buried in the video track and let's have a look at some of our options first of all we've got the um, time bar here the um, which we, we can use to scroll through our video to make some um, rough cuts over here we can zoom in and out which is particularly useful if we zoom in to make some fine editing cuts and also to actually see our, our whole project we can do that but let's have a look at what we've got on option over here if I click I have clicked on the timeline on the icon that I on the clip I want to work with and this menu over here comes up so let's look at some of these options here you'll notice that uh, I've clicked once I've selected the, the um, clip the um, in the monitor here you can see it's got um, options here I can drag it around so let's have a look at this first of all if I click on background I can change the background color so I can click that to green and change the color by default it's black just leave it at that you can make your own colors if you wanted to but let's just drag our icon um, back into space here click on basic we've got some options here we can make it op opaque if we wanted to um, slide those through we can change the size if we want to do that's great for picture in picture but that's the basic look we've had a look at the background we use cutouts that's for people with that later you can fiddle with the audio if it's quite um, quiet you can boost the sound you can fade in and fade out you can add effects on the top if you want to and you can experiment with those let's click on here again um, we can animate it animations can be really um, distracting but you can in and out and a combo if you wanted to that's entirely up to you but click on here again the speed option is probably most useful to you if you've got um, options here you can make it play faster if you've got still images this is 45 seconds if I had a still image I could make it a certain number of seconds if I wanted to so those are the basic kind of options and views of our timeline